Нет, нет никого, кроме его одного. Ай-яй-яй-яй-яй-яй. Нет, нет никого, кроме его одного. Ай-яй-яй-яй-яй-яй. Hello, kids. My name is Dr. Schmappelganger. I just made an amazing new discovery. It's called a Torah. It's real simple, really. I have a formula for it. You take Yetzias Mitzrayim, coming out of Mitzrayim, and then you count 49 days, or seven weeks, and then you add a mountain, and you get a Torah. I put some of that formula together and gave it to my uh, little experimental pal Redfish. Uh, he started singing a, a weird song. Hashem gave us a Torah. Do you know why that was? He gave it to us fishies, he gave it just because. Ha 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 Well, I'm pretty sure those were not the right words. But it's just an experiment still. I'm still working on it. We'll get it right sooner or later. Welcome to Yeshiva School's News. This is Brachasaurus Rexman reporting. Please note that no redfish were harmed in the making of this video. And now, on to your program with Mora Esti. Hi, Rufki. Hello, Mora Esti. Rufki, it's night already. Do you want to count Sephira with me? Sure, Mora Esti, but didn't we count Sephira yesterday and the day before? We sure did, but we count Sephira for whole seven weeks. Wow, Mora Esti, that's really cool. Sephira must be very important if we count it for a whole seven weeks. What are we counting anyway? Well, Rifki, Sephira is very important. That's because we're counting the days from the time we left the Mitzrayim until we got the Torah. Rifki, I have a special friend that could tell you all about it. Children, do you want to talk to my special friend too? Come on. Hi, Mora Esti. Hi, Rifki. Hi, children. It's me, Al the Alien. I'm going to tell you all about Sephiroth HaOmer. It all started many, many years ago when the Yidin were slaves in Mitzrayim to the evil, evil Paro. Well, Hashem brought many, many makos on the Egyptians. And finally, Paro let the people go. But then he chased after them, trying to bring them back to be slaves again. And Hashem made many miracles at the Yamsuf and saved the Jewish people. Well, after they came out of Mitzrayim, Hashem gave them a very, very special gift. He decided to give them the Torah, which he had saved just for them from the time he created the world. But you see, when you get a special present like that, you have to prepare yourself to get the gift. In fact, when the Yidden got the Torah, they were making a special relationship with Hashem, kind of like a chassan and kala when they get married. So when you prepare for such a special thing, you want to count 
the days down and prepare yourself good by learning Torah and doing mitzvahs. But you see, it's really even more special than that because every single year we come out of Mitzrayim again and Hashem brings us out in order to give us the Torah. Well, not us. Aliens don't didn't get the Torah. But all of you Jewish children, you get the Torah every single year. So that's why we count every single year, because we are counting and making ourselves better by honoring our parents and learning Torah and davening and giving tzedakah and getting ourselves all ready to receive the very special gift, the Torah. Wow, Mora Esti, Sfirah to Omar really is important. Can we count Sfirah right now? We sure can. Let's call Tati to help us. Okay, Rifki. Okay, Mora Esti. Is everybody ready for Sfirah to Yes, we are. Yeah. Okay, make the bracha with me. Baruch Ata. Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Kiddishanu B'mitzvaysa B'tzivanu Al Sefiras HaOmer Now repeat after me Hayoyim Asara Yomim Shehem Shavua Echod Ushloisha Yomim LaOmer Today Today is ten days. Is ten days. Which they are. Which they are. One week. One week. And three days. And three days. Of the Omer. Of the Omer. Good job, everybody. Thank you. Rifki, you counted Sferosa Omer so nicely that now I'm gonna give you a special proof. <gasps> Yay! What is it, Mora Asti? You're going to hear a special story from Eliza and her magic sketchboard. Children, you counted so nicely that now you're going to have this special treat too. Come with us. Hi, Eliza. Hi there, kids. It's me, Shofferman. Remember me? Well, I have a special song for you for Sefira Saomer. Shavuos is coming nearer and nearer. That's why we count the Sefira. Shavuos is coming nearer and nearer. That's why we count the Sephira. Around our Sinai waiting for Moshe. Moshe Rabbeinu gave us the Torah. From HaKadosh Baruch Hu. From HaKadosh Baruch Hu. See you next time, kids. Bye. Rifki, wasn't that special? It sure was, Mora Esti. Okay, kids, I'm back. Remember me? I'm Dr. Schmapplganger. Well, turns out, I made a little mistake before in the formula. By accident, I put only 47 days instead of 49 days into the formula. And we all know, 47 days doesn't make a whole Sefirasa Omer. Well, let's see how the formula does now. Hopefully, these adjustments will work.
Hashem gave us a present. Do you know what it was? He gave us the Torah so we could keep its laws. He asked the many nations, do you want this gift of mine? But they said, no, thank you, the Torah's not for us. Then to Bnei Yisroel, Hashem did go. We said, Nasa Venishma, cause we love Hashem so. Then to Bnei Yisroel, Hashem did go. We said, Nasa Venishma, cause we love Hashem so. <laughs> All righty dighty. That was much, much, much better. I say we can call that experiment a success. Well, I'll see you later, kids. I gotta go see if I can figure out how to build a supersonic toothbrush for monkeys. See ya. Rivki, now that we learned so much about Sferasa Irma, I would like to ask you a few questions to see what you remember. Okay, Mara Esti. What is Sferasa Irma? The counting of the Omer. Why are we counting Sferasa Irma? Because we are counting the days until Hashem gave us the Torah. What time of the days do we count Sferasa Irma? At night, after the stars come out. For how many days do we count Sferas Arma? 49 days, which is 7 weeks. What happens after 49 days? Hashem gave us the Torah. What do we call special day that Hashem gave us the Torah? We have a special Yandav called Shavuot. Did we only receive Torah once? No, Mara Esti. Hashem gives us the Torah every single year. Each and every one of us receives the Torah every single year of Shavuos. Good job, Rivki. So proud of you. Thank you. Now, it's time for us to go, children. But just remember to say Spiros Arimer because it's a very special mitzvah. Bye. <laughs>